Greetings and welcome to Eat It Lose. Today I'm going to be testing out a gadget, the Pogo Whisk. I'm trying to figure out a way to hold it. There we go. The Pogo Whisk with pump action. Yeah. It whisks four times faster than something. I'm not entirely sure. I'm guessing doing it by hand. But it doesn't say that. And with it, I can froth, whip, mix, or blend. So it's a versatile tool. It also comes in French. Ooh. With each of which each with each push on the handle, it spins the head four times. Yeah. So let's go ahead and give this thing a shot. I have not tried this. It's still even in its plastic. It's still even in its sealed plastic. I'm glad I had my scissors out for some reason. There we go. The handle's purple. Yay, my favorite. Okay, let's go ahead and give this a try. I have two egg, egg whites in here, and I'm gonna make a meringue with them. So let's go ahead and get this going. Oh yeah. I could say something double entendre, but you know, we've had enough French today. I'm starting to get a little bit of bubbles on top. I imagine I'm gonna fast forward this so you don't have to watch me do this for however long it takes me to get to my stiff peaks. Oh, it's starting to whiten just ever so slightly. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward this. I've been at it in earnest for about a minute and I'm getting some pretty good results. It's almost all white now. Not quite to even soft peaks, but we're getting there. Two minutes. Three minutes. Four minutes plus. Five minutes and I'm almost at soft peaks. There, oh no, I'm right at soft peaks. Maybe just slightly under. I'm at six minutes and I actually have really nice soft peaks now. Can't really see that, but pretty nice soft peaks. I think I have hard peaks now. And that's a pretty nice hard peak. I mean, it's holding its shape pretty well. So yeah, it took um, about eight minutes uh, seven minutes to get there, sorry. So yeah, this worked pretty well. I have an electric mixer, probably would have worked better. But you know, it's a good device to try. I got it for $3.99 at Ollie's in their like as seen on TV section because it is as seen on TV. So yeah, this is actually a pretty nice device, especially for somebody who might have issues with wrists or elbows, having some problems there. My arm did get a little tired. I kept switching my arms for that reason. But, you know, for something that might be good for accommodating somebody who has um, mobility issues, it's not too bad. I'm gonna make some brown sugar meringues from this, see how that goes. And I will talk to you again next week. Bye. Yep. Scout agrees. I know I already said goodbye, but I wanted to touch base with you again. I used the pogo whisk to whisk in my brown sugar cream of tartar and vanilla, and it actually did a pretty good job. My um, meringue is nice and glossy, and it did a pretty good job. I don't think it's quite whipped enough for me to actually bake for meringues, though it's going to be very runny. but. Um, 
I think these are going to turn out pretty nice. I'll see you again next week. Bye-bye.